with Jet, uh, you mentioned he showed you how to play genetics and which, you know, leads us on to like some of his great uh, drumming performances because there's been so many. And I think we were going to do a, a, a top five of that. Yeah, it'd be so, interesting to see if we've got the yeah. same. Have you done? Have you done one as well? I've done a top five. Okay, good. I wonder what if we, there's any crossover. We, yeah, yeah. What should we do? Should we do one each, or how do you want to do it? Yeah, let's do one each and see see how see how we get on. You go first. Right. So in um, ascending order, or like from five, four, three, two, one. Uh, okay. Yeah. In at number five here, drum roll, please. Nice and sleazy from Black and White. Same and as me. Yeah. Oh wow! Wow. Uh, wh- wh- why? What? Wh- why number five? Or why do you love it so much? I just think it's. Um, I mean, it's great fun to play live. Um, mm. And as a as a, it's such a it's a, it's a weird thing to say, but it's such a confident beat. Um, yeah. And it's got such a sort of swagger over this quite mean, dirty song, and the the beat just kind of, you know it pins the whole thing down. It does its own thing. And he, it's played with such a sort of slinkiness that that's what makes, I mean, that's what makes it quite hard to play, to play it right. Is you've got to put that attitude into it. Otherwise yeah. it doesn't, you don't, if you just, if you play it too straight, it doesn't work. Does it? It's got to be played with a bit of, bit of drag and, a, you know, yeah. a bit of, meanness to it yeah absolutely and uh, and uh like just finding that emotion that kind of sleazy feeling you know imagine what you want to get that sitting right you know that that inner game that we bring to it when we play can really emphasize that those qualities you know that can be felt through it you know and sleazy is mm-hmm. great for that and i mean a great drum intro it's just it's one of those iconic ones that it's like it's a hook of the song straight away Boom, boom, yeah. and the drum sound i love the snare drum sound particularly just it's such a great vintage tone there that every time i hear it it's like oh <laughs> i got a smile on my face 